took it out on everybody. But I just, I hate men. Why are you still talking to them? <laughs> Why are you still letting them take you out? I hate men. But God delivered you from that hate. Come on now. Tell somebody, the devil wants you to go back. Some of y'all, oh my God, we got some awesome testimonies in this church, y'all. I mean, we have people in this church that God, seriously, he delivered them from drugs for real, y'all, for real. Oh, oh my, oh, oh my God, if some of these people will tell you their testimony, you might pass out out of shock. But the devil wants you to go back to hitting that pipe. Come on now. He wants you to go back to snorting that cocaine. He wants you to go back to shooting up. Come on. He wants you to go back to smoking that weed. Oh, my, my, my. He, he wants you to go back to those slots. Come on now. Cha-ching. <laughs> but when you think about going back, Think about all that money you lost. Come on now. I won't go back. See, 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 Sister Tish, the, the Bible talks about an unclean spirit going out of a man and, and he walk about. Then he said, I will go back to my house. See, the devil wants you to go back because he wants you back. Mm -hmm. Because, see, we belong to the devil before we got saved. See, when, when you are in sin, you actually belong to the devil. But when you get saved, then you belong to God. Uh-huh. So now what the devil is saying, he said, I want you back. It's like a man that broke up with his girlfriend for another girl. And then he realized what he lost. He said, oh. I think I want her back. Come on now. He starts sending her roses. Come on now. He starts sending her cards. He, he starts opening the door for her like he never did before because he want her back. And I'm here to tell you, look at somebody dead in their face and say, the devil wants you back. Come on now. The, 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 the devil wants you back. Uh huh. He, he wants you to go back to sagging your pants. Come on now. He wants you to go back in the streets. I know you got that suit and tie on, but before you got saved, your britches was way down here looking like a fool. Come on now. Walking around like a, come on. They say that that come from prison. I ain't, I ain't going to tell y'all why though, but just don't go back. He's trying to trick you. Y'all know the devil mess with your feelings. Oh, he will play with your emotions. Mm -hmm. Some of y'all, the devil got you. <laughs> Some of y'all, <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. Some of y'all, the devil got, got you think you going crazy. Come on. Ooh, you hearing stuff. Come on. What you say to me? I ain't say nothing. <laughs> Get your hand out my pocket. <laughs> Woo, you, oh my God, could he take me that way? I, I know I'm, you got it. I'm, I'm in my sound mind. I'm not crazy. I'm not, I, can, you, I can't be saved and crazy. Come on now. Okay, I know, I don't know what church y'all from, but because uh, they teach you can be demon possessed. They, they teach y'all. You cannot be saved and crazy, y'all. So y'all that's crazy, if you don't want to be crazy no more, get saved. Because those pills ain't working. Come on now. Somebody say, if you don't want to be crazy, get saved. Ooh, but he, he had me thinking, I, I was hearing stuff. Hearing voices. I said, hold on now. now that's only me and my wife that live here. Come on. Now, I said, no, nah, I'm devil. I know it's you talking to me. I, I'm, I, I, come on, I'm not schizophrenic. Come on now. I don't, come on. The devil will try to make you think you have split personality disorder. Come on. You, why are you talking to yourself? I ain't talking to myself yesterday. You just did it. Sometimes I'm not. The heel put so much pressure on you. My God, you'll be going through so much drama. You'll be so tired, so exhausted. You will feel like you're losing your mind. You have to make up your mind. Uh, 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 uh. I'm not allowing the enemy to do that. Come on, he, the devil will mess with your head. He'll mess with your head, y'all. 
Mm-hmm. So, so see, you saints, I want to tell you this. You going to need some strength. Because the devil is throwing knockout punches. He's fighting dirty. He's hitting below the belt. He don't care if he use your kids. I remember when Deacon D.L. got saved. He said his dog turned on him. Come on. He had to take the dog out. <laughs> he buried him now. <laughs> My God, I'm the, 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 the fish should be looking at you crazy. Come on now. My God, the devil are getting all type of stuff. Woo! So you, I'm telling you, you're going to need some strength to fight the devil. And see, some of y'all just missed your strength. See, the Holy Ghost just came on in to strengthen us, y'all. Uh-huh. Be- because he know you're going to have to take some punches. That's why. He said, oh, I got a blessed missionary, Boogaloo. Come on now. I got a blessed deacon, Tutu, because the devil going to hit them hard. So I'm going to send a praise their way. Come on now. And that praise is your pillow. Oh, oh my God. Tell somebody, you, you, you need your pillow. Oh, y'all didn't say that. Tell somebody, you need your pillow. And I want you to understand something. Your praise is your pillow. Uh huh. It, it was funny, y'all, because we got a lot of whippings, y'all. We was bad. But one time I got smart. Uh huh. My mama used to whoop us at night, because, you know, <laughs> you know, you got a bunch of boys in the room. We're going to act a fool. And, and she used to come in the room all the time and she used to whoop our butts, y'all. I mean, ooh, I'm talking about swinging. And she heavy handed, too. And do you know, uh, come on, we, we call in and we said, okay, when they say be quiet, we're going to be quiet. But what they didn't understand, it was Stefan singing church songs. <laughs> you know, we kids, you grow up in church, you know, they singing Jay. That's why you raise your kids in church, because instead of singing Jay-Z and 50 Cent, he'd be, they'd be singing church song. But my daddy be like, now y'all be quiet, go to bed. Okay, we, it'll be quiet. Instead of be singing, Jesus on the man. Like, <laughs> I said, be quiet, go to bed. Oh, oh, yes, Dad, yes, Dad. He'd be, be quiet for 15, 15 more minutes. What do you want the Lord to say? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Stephen. Oh, they'll bust through the door, swing. <laughs> so I said, okay, he's not going to stop singing, y'all. He gonna, <laughs> I got some pillows and put them, come on now, put them right there. <laughs> And when Stephen kept singing, and they thought we were just acting a fool, my mom came in and started swinging. I'm laughing. Because <laughs> she was hitting me. She didn't realize I had some pillows. <laughs> and what I'm trying to tell you is that your praise is your pillow. Uh-huh. So that's why it's so important for you to give God praise. I know people don't understand why we shout and people don't understand why we dance and, and people don't understand why we run around. Ooh, somebody shout out my praise. It's my pillow. Because when I go home, come on now, the devil going to throw some punches at me. Come on. When I go to my job, come on, uh, he gonna throw some punches at me. Uh, even in the church, uh, you know the devil would try to punch you uh, in the church. Uh, that's why everywhere you go, uh, make sure uh, you got your pillow with you. Uh, so when the devil swing, come on, swing on me. When the devil try to hit you, uh, when the devil try to knock you out, uh, when the devil try to knock you out, uh, he punching at you, uh, he swinging at you. Uh, but your praise, come on, come on now. But your praise, uh, your praise, uh, your praise, uh, your praise uh, is your pillow. Uh, and without your pillow, uh, if the enemy hits you uh, and you don't have your pillow, uh, your tooth going to fall out. Uh, you gonna have a black eye huh? your nose gonna start bleeding huh? and that's what's wrong with some of you huh? the devil knock your tooth out huh? your nose is bleeding huh? you got a black eye huh? you need to get your pet out Woo! oh mama I'm keeping my pillow huh? and the more I pray huh? I'm through y'all. I'm almost finished y'all. <laughs> 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 
see, see, some of y'all like to sleep with one pillow. But if I go to some of y'all house, what is it called, a, a, a fetish? I don't know. You a pillow hoarder. A pillow hoarder. She said, uh, okay, that's, that's a more proper word for it, a pillow collector. <laughs> Oh, if we go to your house, my God, why you had 10 pillows on your bed? Woo! But the more I praise them, Deacon. Oh, y'all, y'all, y'all not getting it. Because I don't. Go give me y'all, give me those. Yeah, I'm y'all gonna get this one. Because I don't want the devil to knock me out. I want to stay saved, y'all. 